Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the bizarre magic of Brian Rushworth. remember, I've always wanted to do weird, bizarre, freaky magic, but when I was a kid, I never had any money, so I had to buy junk at the garage sales, which meant a lot of secondhand busted crap. But one day, I found the best magic trick I'd ever seen. Uh, it was old and busted. It was so old that the instructions for it actually came in film strip format. Now, we're all too young to remember film strips, most of us, but some of us, but back in the 1950s, they had 35 millimeter strips of film that you would advance by hand while they synchronized up with a record player. It would beep when it was time to go on to the next frame. So I had my brother run the film strip projector. What I'm gonna do is recreate for you what it looked like when I was a kid, trying to learn my first bizarre magic trick while I was doing it. So pretend I'm a kid. Here we go. and mysterious art. Magic is also a fun, hilarious, and wacky way for you to entertain your parents. The Postman. Yes, even astronauts are amazed by magic. But how can you use magic to entertain all these people? The idiots you are rude Yes, everything you need to perform this incredible illusion is included in the box. Start by selecting a volunteer from the audience. Right, let me get a girl to help me out. Asking her to join. Uh, yeah, I saw your hand first. Let's give her a huge round of applause as she joins me here on stage. Here, that'll be your spot. We're gonna learn how to do a magic trick. You ready? Perfect. Here we go. Prove to her that yours is a normal tongue by having her carefully inspect it. <laughs> Make sure there are no piercings. Uh, no, my when your volunteer is confident that yours is a normal, unaltered tongue, you can move on to the next step. All right, perfect. Now reach into the box and pull out the long skewer. Just as she inspected your tongue, have your volunteer carefully examine your skewer. Right. When your volunteer is satisfied that there's nothing tricky about the skewer, you're ready to begin. To perform the incredible skewer through tongue trick, simply grab your tongue with your left hand. Hold the skewer in your right and stab the skewer directly through your tongue. That's right, stab the skewer directly through your tongue. At this point, your audience should be very amazed. Enthusiastic. But what the audience didn't see is that you never really stabbed the skewer through your tongue at all. <laughs> you really switched the original skewer for the gimmicked one in the box. <laughs> Aren't you clever? <laughs> if by mistake you forgot to perform the switch and instead stab yourself with the original skewer, don't panic. <laughs> Simply reach into the box and pull out the pair of emergency shoes designed for just such an occasion. Take those emergency shears, hold them up to the problem area, and simply cut it off. That's right, cut it off. <laughs> Know that you're a okay by smiling big and bowing to countless applause. Now you couldn't have performed this illusion by yourself, so thank your volunteers by 
giving her the skewer. It was a perfect reminder of how much fun you had today. They don't want me giving away the giant 12 inch skewer for security reasons, so you got a choice. You can either keep that lovely, bloody chunk of fake tongue, or you can trade it for a copy of Cheats, Cots, Riddles, and Tricks 57 Ways to Scam a Free Drink. Uh, yeah. She's gonna take the book. I'll give you the book and the tongue. There you go. I know uh, I made some promises. People were asking if it was appropriate to bring their kids. I know people brought their kids. Uh, I don't want to get in trouble later, so let me just make it clear now. Uh, kids, if, if you go home and, and you cut off your tongue, it grows back instantly. It is awesome. 